In this lesson, I show you how to manage and organize your widgets. Widgets are like plugins that you can rearrange on your website. They appear on the sidebar of your website, and as you can see right now, we have some stuff already on the sidebar. Pages, archives, categories, and so on. This is the default layout for WordPress's uh, widgets. We can change this by going into the dashboard on the back end of our website and clicking on Appearance. Then we can click on the Widgets button right there. Now here you have your available widgets and you can add more to this list if you choose. Now it's a matter of dragging and dropping the order of which you want your um, sections to appear. So let's say we want to start with categories. We can simply drag and drop it right on sidebar one. Now if you have more sidebars for your theme you can add these widgets to other sidebars. Again it just depends on your theme mostly. So let's say now you want to change the title. Let's say you don't want to say categories. So we can go ahead here and let's just name it, I don't know, sections just for you know um, this tutorial's sake. And you have some options here too like maybe you want to be a drop down menu. Maybe you want to show the post counts for each category. Maybe you want to show the hierarchy so that your subcategories are indented or look different than your regular categories. So anyway, let's just go ahead and pick a couple of these. Maybe I want it to be a drop down, and then I hit save. Then I go back to my website and I just hit refresh. And now you see the um, widget in action. It's labeled sections, it's a drop down, you see the post count behind it. You click it, it takes you to that category, and you can see all the posts within that category, which there's only one right now, but that's just because this tutorial is just for demonstration purposes. You're probably going to have a lot more. Anyway, when you come back here, you can rearrange this in any way you want. We can go and let's add a calendar in here. So we just kind of go through and drag and drop right in like that. And there's no real options there other than title. Let's say we want our recent comments from our visitors on the sidebar, so we just go in and put it in like that. You can number it, you can show how many comments you want, and you can, let's also add a search bar to our website too. And we'll just keep that the way it is. And we'll just save these, make sure they're good to go. We just go to our website, and we'll just go back to the home page here. And we have our sections, we have a calendar, we have a search, and we have the recent comments, which there are none at the moment, but if there were comments, they would appear right there. So there you go. That is basically how you can organize the sidebars on your websites. Widgets make it incredibly easy to do. And again, you can also add more widgets to your theme. And it all depends on your theme too. If you're using a really old theme, they it might not um, accept widgets very easily. It really depends. However, all current themes should accept widgets. So if you're new to WordPress and you're just diving into this and you're getting new themes, you should be fine. Anyway, I hope you guys found this helpful. I have more tutorials coming up, so stay tuned.